कि हमारा एजुकेशन सिस्टम ये है हमारा एजुकेशन सिस्टम वो है All through your life, you have insisted on your child. You should get best of the marks, and you contributed in terms of spoiling. That has to change if education has to change. It's not just an institution, a law. The entire social fabric contributes to your life. Election, uh, the baby, I taking uh, knowledge from the class from the our collaborative. It may be the reflection of that thing that we. Put in uh, doing our self work. Little more, little more. Anyone else? Yeah, you tell me more. Yeah, voice. I hardly see any voice. I have to use microscope to find this. Thank you. Please, thank you. Yeah, thank you. Reflection is when you go back home. Just how to entire day read. क्या क्या आपने पढ़ा सीखा? Was it good? What did you add for the day? Her day, कुछ ना कुछ value addition होना चाहिए भी करना चाहिए। तो रिव्यू करके आज क्या नया सीखा? Right? अगर कुछ भी नहीं सीखा तो एक्चुअली before going to the sleep rewind, very clear याद रहेगा। Right? अगर कुछ तुमको याद है सीखा है तो उसको बारे में how can I use it? How do I apply it? एक बहुत अच्छे एजुकेशन इस समय है उन्होंने उनका नाम था क्रॉस पॉप जो मैंने आपको दिया जो एक्चुअल एंड इट्स इम्पोर्टेंट टू नो दैट बट इफ यू डू नॉट नो व्हाट टू डू विद दैट देन आवर एजुकेशन ऑफ नो यूज अंदर स्टूडेंट सो यू मेंबी नोइंग लॉट ऑफ थियरीज एंड यू नो एंड यू 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 मस्ट बी आस्क एग्जाम्स एक्सप्लेन दिस व्ह Define this, all that is factual knowledge. Next time you conceptualize, I already spoken about it. That is your ability to relate the facts with each other. How they are related, what do they impact? What if one is increased, what is what it can do on the other one? Right? That is factual. Third is procedural, which also I spoke to you. That means your ability to know how the knowledge is implemented. What are the steps in that? अगर आपको कोई भी skill करनी है तो procedural पता होना चाहिए ना procedural knowledge ये कैसे होता है? तो what are the skills we have defined? Do you have the copy of the skills we have? Which class is this? Which year is this? I mean they should know procedural knowledge. Which skills are you doing? Any skills you are doing? Psychomotor skills? Can I get it? Procedures. Procedures. Sir, you do a process in lab, right? Yes, sir. We have made a fact sheet. Do you want to share it? Sir, it doesn't matter. They know only for procedure. They know only for procedure. You have to give that fact sheet. Share it. You don't have to give it. You don't have to give it. You just want to share it with the students. No, you don't have to give it. Sir, last year you told for the admission onwards, we have started the last year admission, we started. Yes, these people have gone through, you know. So I'm asking, once they have gone through, we should have shared with them that thing. Okay, sir. I'm not worried. This is knowledge about knowledge. When we say thinking about thinking, that means, do you know what you know? Do you know what you do not know? Do you know where would like you know what you do not know? मतलब आपको अपनी नॉलेज के बारे में पता है कि मुझे कितना पता है इसके बारे में और मुझे क्या क्या नहीं पता आपकी कोई भी स्किल बात कर रहा है अगर आज नर्स आपको ये पूरे स्टेप नहीं मालूम है और आप वो काम करना शुरू कर दें तो उसका रिजल्ट क्या होगा सो डू यू नो व्हाट यू आर सपोज टू नो डू यू आल्सो नो व्हाट एल्स यू डू नॉट नो इन दिस एंड व्हाट एल्स यू बी नॉट this is metacognitive. When you start questioning your own knowledge, and that's a part of reflection also. Unless you engage in that thinking, brooding over what you 
know or what you do not know, you cannot develop as a good professional. So always do that brooding, you know, thinking. Don't always indulge into passing tests, passing exam. That is not going to happen. So what over a period of time has in fact resulted in okay, this go up a two three three case in which I said no. That is uh, data information. Knowledge and uh, intelligence and last one is wisdom. Wisdom. Ultimately, ye five things in kisi bhi professional me jaane zaroori. And you will know that all of them are interrelated. These are interrelated. Data. Data is a fact, piece of information, which will keep changing. <coughs> right? Now, if you have a piece of data, is there any information in it? You say, what does it mean? What does it mean? When you have know, multiple pieces of information, that makes a knowledge. Knowledge be about your profession, knowledge about a specific subject. Right. And intelligence care? What are intelligent for to me? Skill. Madam, very skill. Aap kya kare? Ability to think. Ability to think, okay? What else? Incorporate the knowledge into your practice. Okay, bring knowledge into practice, okay? Good. What else you think? Aap asu baat dekhe to what intelligent to not necessarily. We don't know what has been tested. <laughs> Maybe on information, your knowledge level that test key or facts test key only. So you can't say whether it is intelligent or not. Intelligence means one's ability, ability is always linked to the skill, one's ability to use knowledge. One's ability to use knowledge. knowledge. If you cannot use knowledge, then that's of no use. And you know that, that knowledge always forms part of the memory. <coughs> RAM, 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 memory, the one which is used for operations. Right? And that fades away. But if you start using it, it remains always with you. So unless you use knowledge, it will not stay with you for long. If you start using it, it will stay intelligence. Okay. So your ability to use knowledge. Another problem with most of our students is that we don't carry pen and paper. Most of us. We I am not today. I've been observing for years together, whether we are in a seminar, whether in a conference. Knowledge and if you want to develop yourself, it always comes in pieces. You go to draw it every time, every day, everywhere. I don't know how much of you will remember what I said. Can you remember that? No. Once say you are wasting this one hour time. You should tell the principal, man, it's all best of time. And who is responsible for that? <laughs> You don't have a pen and paper. <coughs> Even at this age, <coughs> I always have pen, paper in my pocket, anything new, not necessary to my own profession, anything new, technology, whatever, any new word, yes, not a doubt. You have to go to the table, and you have to go to the table. What is the problem? Broadly. Because if you if you don't stay relevant, then the, the waste of time yours and 
I know Mira to Hogan, but after the Hogan. And the last one is wisdom. What is wisdom? Mean? This is not a new word to you. You keep hearing it every day and now. What is wisdom? Okay, I'll just give an example. That's your ability to adapt to the situation. Let me say, for example, how do you speak to your mother, your sister, your teacher, unknown person, your friend? It's not working in the same way. Is it going to be? That's what it's saying. That means when to use which knowledge? It depends upon the circumstances. So you should be able to fit the circumstance and your knowledge, your piece of knowledge. Now work, you know, pieces of knowledge. Now that can be used everywhere in any context. The context scares the answer of knowledge. You can use it as behave. That becomes your wisdom. And everyone should carry this if you want to be successful in this. Okay? कौन से पेशेंट के साथ में कौन से पेशेंट के जो यू नो रिलेटिव आए हैं उनके साथ में कैसा व्यवहार करना है ये आपको आना चाहिए से टेन मिनट्स बैक यू हैड अ पेशेंट्स रिलेटिव्स वो वर रॉबर्ट डॉग यू वर रेज योर वॉइस राइट वो यू वर क्वाइट डू दैट बट द नेक्स्ट वन यू हैव अ डोसाइल गाइड कमिंग एन एजुक so nice to you. You can't even the same. This is where the, your wisdom comes. So depending upon the circumstances, you use your knowledge. That's the part of the wisdom. Okay? And also called gardener's multiple intelligence. Or they also call styles of learning. Their school of learning talks about how a child retains information. How a child retains information. So it's advised that a teacher should use multiple ways. You know, if if he or she speaks only, lectures only, the only ten percent of that could be retained by the student. But if she or he writes also, then the retention increases. That is, when you show something, the retention is high. Third, when he or she writes it, that's why you know many of us, uh, uh, you know. Teachers, but we don't know why we make our children to, you know, why and why do we dictate? It's because when you write, you remember much more than one when you see and hear. So when you when you hear, when you see and write, you know, children are there. Retention is almost about sixty percent. This is why I said carry pen. Write whatever you hear and see, and if you do it, whatever is being said, you hear and see. If you do it, retention is almost about ninety percent. That's the logic. So now you know how best to learn. Writing makes you learn much better than, and if you can put that into practice, then it is not. The next one is styles of learning. हम में से हर बच्चे को एक अलग तरीका पसंद है सीखने का. Somebody likes only auditory, मतलब सुनना. Others learn better through visuals. Some learn through verbal means, the words we say. Some learn better through kinesthetics, that means by doing. Some learn better by Solitary. Solitary means अकेले पास। उसको किसी भी particular shape में लेके। ठीक है। किससे बनी है? Plastic तो पानी फेंकता है कभी? जब पे इसको board नहीं किया है। So you need a molding machine, isn't it? 
Does a degree mold you? <laughs> no, you have to mold yourself. You have to mold yourself. Third, second word, educate means to bring out from within. Bring out. Bring out your potential. How some potential man whose potential to recognize that game, practice ke madam se You have potential to become real big in life. But you cannot unless otherwise that potential is you. So two important things success ke liye. Main do bata raha hu. Baaki ke bahut se aisa nahi hai. Aur success ka meaning kya hai? Wo bhi alag alag hai. Aap liye kabhi fir baat karenge. Mokka milta hai. Aap log ki principal mera mokka nahi hai to aaj ka. Main kuch karenge. Aap koi ho jaa karo. ठीक है. Two important things. That is one is talent. And another one is of course. मैंने मल्टीप्लाई किया एड नहीं किया रिमेंबर दैट साइन टैलेंट एंड अफोर्ड आप कितने भी टैलेंटेड होंगे अगर अफोर्ड नहीं डालोगे यू कैन नॉट सक्सीड इन दैट यू विल नॉट बी एबल टू अचीव एनीथिंग देयर आर मेनी एग्जांपल्स अक्रॉस हाईली टैलेंटेड स्पोर्ट्स पर्संस डिड नॉट प्रैक्टिस वेल ये लड़का पांड्या का नाम था पांड्या यस सर ये का The mom of both this guy is good sense, tremendous. And the day one stops doing that, you adjust with your whatever age, right? And there is no age to learn. You want to know? You know, our university has achieved a distinction in the country that we have produced the oldest PhD student in our country, in our university. That's an 80 years old. He was awarded a PhD degree about a month back under my guidance. Eighty years ago, he wanted to quit. He said, "No, go away. No, no, you are making me too work more." But it's been the fun, yeah, yeah. Asi saal ke toh ke desh ke taraf ka naam. See, you know, you as a as a teacher, you have to. That's his idea. This idea is going to complete. That is, unfortunately, over a period of time, you have a student. You have a teacher, and you have institute. ये triangle है? इनके बीच में जो relationship है, that has become transactional, transactional. The relationship between student teacher and institution has become transactional over a period of time kaise transactional hua this was it kya hai student ko kya chahiye bol bach degree chahiye knowledge bhi degree hai kyunki thode the baat kuch nahi hai yeah the greatest scientist and still naam suna hai uska usse kisi ne pucha ki knowledge kya hai unhone kya bola knowledge is what is left behind after a student has forgotten everything that he wrote in the examination then what is left behind what he did during his four five years of time jo aapne kiya hai that means physically kiya hai only that will remain with you baaki ye to theory ke baad jo aap kar rahe ho wo do teen mein baad mein aapko sab examination ke liye and this is more relevant in government universities wahan koi ye baat nahi karta hai ki skill hai aap ye less lecture hai wo lecture hai tum aaye ho ki nahi aaye ho no guess no guess unless otherwise we change this relationship from transactional to transformational We cannot change education. Now, to make that both student and teacher have to come together. That is, for me, what is most okay? Then, what is most important thing in education? In your mind, what is most important thing in education? Interest. Huh? Interest. 
Interest of who? Student. Student's interest. Very good. Yeah. Anyone else? Student teacher relations. Shooter two way teacher student relationship. Or what I आप कौन को पूछ नहीं पाए? तुम ले रहे थे ना लेने की शोर की बात कर रहे हैं ना? घर पे वो बैठे हैं उनकी बात कर रहे हैं। बताइए like a teacher asking questions or a student asking questions, those questions which have a single right answer. Do you understand that? Single right answer is no way to learn anything. The question which you pose to your student or students who ask questions should have multiple answers. That indicates a different perspective to be added or learned to become a success. So when you, when you check answers, see, you should look for the perspective which a student is in rather than what is written in the book. Unless otherwise you are asking the definition. Your definition cannot have more perspective. Definition is a definition, that is standardized. Okay? So this has to be changed into transformation. The question arises how do we actually transform this? How do we move from these three individuals' objectives of completing course, earning degree, and conducting examination? This triangle has to be broken down if you really want the transformation. And for that, we need to understand that two meaning Right? That means two most important element in education is These are the two most important elements of education. Who is being shaped and who is shaping? Shaped means transforming. Who is being shaped? <laughs> Students. And who is shaping? Teachers. <laughs> 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 Rest all in superficial. Unless we focus on these two, transformation cannot happen. We might, UGC might try to bring any amount of changes, the one which is bringing these all are superficial. They don't add to the quality. And another, most important thing, one needs to also identify and learn what quality means in education. A lot of people don't even understand quality. A lot of us don't understand quality. Now, when it comes to this relationship, I am reminded of Smith's hurt and cold iron. That's the story. Blue heart, dekha? Dekha hai? Uska hurt, chula dekha? Handa loa dekha? Agar usko wo shape dena chahta hai, to kya karna hai? Heat. 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 Who will heat it? Iron. So, iron, poor thing is, poor thing is, no living. So, of course, hang it on. But are you ready for that? You have to ask yourself. Are you ready for the hurt? And is your teacher ready to blow the pipe into the hurt? Because I'm happy to ask you. The more the time, the cold iron stays in the hurt, more the teacher blows it, it becomes easiest for the blacksmith to mold or give it any shape he or she desires. That's it. It's all about it. Education. If these two are not ready, then the relationship would be all about transaction. Aap degree lete jaiye, hume jam kandar karate jaiye, aur humare teachers, of course. ये होता है, होता रहा है, but now we don't need to think about it. It cannot last for long. It has to be the readiness of a student. There is no choice for us. No choice. 
Okay? And why it is important for you to get it ready. Unless you are ready, there's no point going to college or coming to the class, attending the class, wasting your time. You change your mindset and you realize yourself how enjoyable this two way interaction is. If you mind somewhere else, what are you going to do? Up in your room, or up in body, class number two. Very nice. Number two, practice. Whatever you hear, right in the classroom, please practice it. Read it a couple of times, do it. The more you practice, the more you will get. Effect means, aap jo kar rahe hain, jo bhi kar rahe hain, par rahe hain, us mein aapko achha samaj mein aare hain. Agar aap mein khas samaj mein aare, then you will like to do more. How many of you are fearful of? And that gap that you feel unless otherwise, you are ready and you practice. If you want to fill any gap, if you want to fill any gap, the readiness and practice has to be there and there is no age, no time for filling the gap. Now I need a little bit of math for that, but no, it's not right. Math develops your ability to logic, ability to analyze. It enhances that content and which you will use as you move in your life further and further. Nothing is. Whatever you do is not ever going to be used this way. Remember that. At whatever stage you do it. Okay? And so if you learn that, whether it is the same with the English words, many, many of us are not from who come from rural better not able to speak. Why? Same gap. And that scarcity is there in your mind, you are really on Kyaga. Why should you mind? What others are going to mind about you? They will mind otherwise also. You improve, you speak. Keep practicing. If you feel like it's good, you will enjoy it more. And then you will practice more. Doesn't matter. Right, wrong. Hold the road. Seek the road. And one day you will not practice. What if you don't do this? Gap to the right? Why do you say that? Why do you say that?